Why hello everyone and welcome back to Samcast GS. I hope you had a good weekend. I know I did. I went to the zoo with Caitlin. Finally. Weather was perfect. I got some good vlogging in there. We actually got lost on the way down there. When we got to downtown Indy, there was a whole bunch of people who were going to Lucas Oil Stadium for the game. So the police had like closed off several roads. So we were just like, there is nowhere to go. I mean, we're supposed to go down West Street, but as we were coming in towards West Street, we uh missed it. But we kept driving because we're like, hey, maybe we didn't miss it. Maybe it's farther down. But it wasn't farther down. So we ended up going in a circle for about 15 minutes. Then we finally got to the zoo and we were so excited. The first thing we did was go to the oceans exhibit. You know, when you go into that building and there's a whole bunch of aquariums and stuff. I wanted to do part of my vlog in there, but it was way too dark. I got to pet a shark. They have those dog sharks and then you could reach down and pet them. And there were all kinds of fish and eels and such. So that was a good time. We also got to see the penguins. I love penguins. It was just funny to watch them hopping across the rocks in their exhibit and then dive underneath the floor where there's like a window and you can see them swimming back and forth. From there we walked out and we were just walking around because we were waiting for the dolphin show because we had like a half hour to wait for the dolphin show. So we just sat by the polar bear for a second. Well, we weren't actually sitting by the polar bear. That would have been a bad idea. We were standing outside of the glass and looking at the polar bear. Because sitting next to a polar bear is just not a good idea. Sitting next to a rabid polar bear is an even worse idea. Though the polar bear at the zoo wasn't rabid. But I still wouldn't sit next to it. So then we went to the dolphin show and I got some good footage of some tricks. They did like this five minute intro of all the dolphins, which I had initially recorded, but it took up so much recording space that I didn't have a lot of time to record anything else. But after the dolphin show, we went to see the new tiger exhibit. That was fun. One of the tigers was just walking around and looking at the walls. He'd occasionally just walk by and eye the people who were looking at him. But he was seriously wandering around like, there's gotta be a way out of this place. I can't stand these little children calling me a kitty. I used to be the master of my own domain. I love how they advertise the new tiger exhibit. It says, how close is too close? That just sounds irresponsible. I mean, it's safe enough. I mean, I was there. There's no way that the tigers are going to break through the glass unless they really try. They won't really try unless you give them a reason to. But the way they worded it on the big billboard, it sounds like they're just pushing the limits of how close they can get. And that's just irresponsible. It's like, hey people, come in and see how close you can get without getting killed. Obviously, they took all the correct precautions. They know what they're doing, but they could have worded it better. That's all I'm saying. And we saw the red panda again. Oh, it's so cute. It was just running around the environment that it was in because it was new to the zoo. They just got her. It was a girl. They just got her and they put her in the exhibit and there's like this little deer in the exhibit with it. And she kept like walking by the deer and just like, and then just running away. Like she had no idea what to make of this deer being in the exhibit with her. But it was the cutest little animal ever. Oh, it was so cute. But we had a grand old time. I'm gonna try to upload that vlog as soon as I can. Well, I gotta get going because I got some stuff to do. I gotta get ready for my classes later. Feel free to subscribe. There's a link to my channel in the description as always. And as always, I would very much appreciate some more subscribers. Thank you all for tuning in and I will see you on Wednesday.